Uh, welcome to Marriage and Life Stories with Kansi Me. Uh, today we are doing yet another exemplary video that is going to be very, very good for your health, very good uh, a turnaround for your family's health. And uh, I want you to take very keen interest and then make this uh, at your home. Or if you're not able, just give me a call and we'll be able to, to deliver this. Now, this is a very powerful immune booster. In the cases of viruses that are, we are having, that are getting us to cough, that are getting our lungs tight, and that are getting uh, oxygen supply cut out of the body, and we have come up with this, this recipe, with these ingredients, we are going to make this particular recipe, and it's going to be very amazing uh, for our families. Now here with me is uh, we have this plate of uh, it has garlic. Uh, this is the garlic, the organic one, the small. It is the small type that, that is not the imported one. This is the organic small garlic. It is well washed uh, with vinegar. Uh, I, this time I didn't use. I used. Um, I used. Um, let me see. Let me check this out. This is cedar vinegar. This is what I used for today. It's very good. It's antiviral. It's antibacterial. It's very healthy. Even if you drop it in water, you can have it and it will be very good for you. We also have this local garlic. It is well washed, cleaned with this same vinegar, and so it's ready to be, to be used. Now, before I continue, kindly remember to subscribe if you have not. If you have not subscribed before, Please subscribe and like the video and watch videos up to the end. Always the information is systematic from the beginning up to the end. It is all connected. If you watch it halfway, there are very important things that you're going to miss in between. Now, uh, the other ingredient we're going to use, this is lemon juice. I made this lemon juice out of five lemons and I have covered it here in this container. This is a, a PBA free plastic container. So it is very safe. If you look here, it says PBA free. It means it doesn't have the cancer causing agent, this kind of plastic. Most of our plastics are not good, but if you're buying plastic, make sure you look for one which has PBA free. They're a little more expensive, but at the end of the day, it is your health. Okay, another ingredient is this vinegar. This is organic apple cider vinegar uh, with a mother. The mother is this brownish substance that is at the bottom. It is healthy, it helps with arthritis, it helps with indigestion, it helps your body to grow uh, probiotic, pro, uh, the good bacteria in the, in the body, which help to prevent the colon cancers and all that. And uh, this will be a lesson for another day. And for today, let's concentrate on making this recipe. Uh, I also have cinnamon, cinnamon powder, which we are also going to use. Cinnamon is also a very powerful antibacterial, antibiotic, and uh, we also have garlic, uh, sorry, turmeric. Uh, turmeric, now, with the side effect of diseases, of medications and vaccines which you take, and they cause the, the body to, the blood to clot, now you need turmeric. Turmeric will help uh, the blood the blood to thin so when the blood thins it will not give chance for any clotting this is my go-to every day I use it in golden milk I use it in so many other things so it thins blood it doesn't allow any clotting to happen now turmeric is very hard to digest and to absorb in the body and so the only ingredient you need to get turmeric absorbed in the body is black pepper now, a pinch of black pepper in, in turmeric will help this absorption to, to take place very fast. If you don't use black pepper, this one takes longer to absorb. So we use black pepper in turmeric. So it thins your blood. Now, it also helps when the blood is thin, it helps the, the, the heart. It will pump blood faster. Now, once blood is pumped faster, 
your body will have a full supply of, of uh, uh, oxygen. So the many people you see in our ICU right now with this uh, COVID uh, challenges, they die because uh, either the, the lungs have held on too much uh, mucus and, and they cannot uh, supply oxygen, the heart will not supply oxygen. So someone dies of uh, gasping for breath and then uh, they have to bring oxygen and so you can avoid such situations by helping out your doctor. Now, we are not saying don't go to the doctor, go to them, but help your body to overcome uh, the side effects of all those diseases that, that are going to come as a result of this viral infection. Garlic, which I, which I didn't mention, is a strong antiviral. Garlic is a very strong antiviral, and so once you use this garlic, you, you are very sure that uh, much of the things that come as a result of viral infection will be uh, uh, dealt with. Okay, so I use this same vinegar, much as I eat it, I also use it to sanitize my hands because I'm going to touch food. And so when my hands are well sanitized, I'll pick some tissue from this side, okay? So my hands are well sanitized, they are clean. And so I am ready now to start the process. Now these ingredients we are going to use a juicer. We are not going to blend them. We will use a juicer and I extract the juices from these ingredients and then we will be good to go for the next step. Please remember to subscribe, watch up to the end, like and give a comment. And if you have any inquiries, if you want this to be made for you, we can always arrange for that. Okay, so we'll start with the ginger. Now, if you look at the amounts that I'm making, it's the same, the equal amount of garlic and ginger. You have to have equal amounts of both. Okay, so this is my juicer. And I will turn it on. smaller pieces. I, I didn't chop them properly. Okay. Here's my knife. Okay. I will remove them first. Chop them again. I, I used bigger pieces. I thought I would crush them right out. But I normally chop and make them smaller. And the reason we don't add in water, we want uh, the strength of these ingredients. We want them to be quite strong at all times. Then I will show you when the water comes in. At the time that we put in the water. Okay. Remember you sanitize your hands with vinegar vinegar which is uh, edible don't use anything that is not edible at all this is the local garlic the, the organic one not not GMO okay done chopping them in small bits just to be on the safe side, I will chop these ones as well. And then we'll put in smaller amounts. Just one smaller amounts at a time.
So do that, that is just squeezed from five lemons. Now, the good thing about lemon is that um, even when you, when you, when you heat lemon, it, it only loses vitamin C, but the ingredients that you get at the end of the day, they, uh, they work to prevent so many other things, uh, bad, incurable diseases that could come to your body. Okay, now remember, you need to consult with your doctor every time you're going to take something. Uh, and then you avoid what you are allergic to or what your doctor advises you against. We are going to put in uh, the same amount of vinegar, same amount uh, like we got from, from the juices. So this is the same amount of vinegar which we are going to, which we are adding in here. Okay, and we are heating. We are heating this for about, maybe I use gas for about three minutes. Let me use gas, let me heat it on gas. Mm -hmm. Okay, we will heat it on gas because that. Uh, changed from watery to very thick. Okay, so we turn off the heat. Turning off the heat. That's it. how it looks like okay looks like this now something else we are going to add in we are going to add in honey honey with its very strong 
uh, antiviral properties and uh, antifungal properties will, and it will also be the preservative to, to help this. Now, what I need to remind you is that you do not use honey in anything that is hot. You use it uh, when something has cooled down. I uh, will therefore first put this in a, in a plate which uh, a plate of water so that, that, that uh, the, the ingredients cool down so fast. Uh, the ingredients need to cool down first before before we before we, we, we add in the honey. And so I'm using this bucket. I'm going to sit this saucepan in. I'm sitting this saucepan in and I'll keep stirring so that the heat can go out so fast. And you, and you really be careful that it doesn't water doesn't get in. This water that I'm using, I just got it from the tap. So I will hold the saucepan so that uh, it doesn't tilt to allow the water to go in. Okay, it's about to get to that temperature that I want. Okay, meanwhile I can show you one which is ready. it is. Now, when you take this, the things of tightening the chest, the things of running out oxygen and waiting for you to be put on the oxygen cylinder, gas cylinder, or, or what, oxygen cylinder and whatever, you will have minimized them. The things of blood clotting in your body, you will have minimized them. You take your medication, but you minimize the symptoms um, with these recipes. Okay, I'll keep this one, it's an order for someone. Okay, I think it is cool right now. This is how we used to cool the porridge for children in, in the village. You get the porridge, cook it very fast, put it in a, a plate or in a, a saucepan of water, keep stirring, and before you know it, the temperatures have gone down. Right? Okay. It's cool now. You can see the one holding the saucepan. There is no more heat. If you hold the water, you'll find that the water is, a, is getting warm. Okay. Now, the last ingredient that you are going to put in is honey. Now, the honey that you put in has to be twice the amount. I already measured this. The juice was stopping here, so you can see this honey is, is up there. I, I used the same amount and, and I, I have gotten this one. Now, this honey is organic. It is not adulterated. It will... Um, crystallize when, when the temperatures get very low and so that is the best honey that you can use in most of the things because it does it is not adulterated at all okay so there we go there we go with the uh, mixture remember there is a there is vinegar i'll keep it inside here there is a turmeric, uh, there is cinnamon, there is black pepper, and there was uh, lemon juice as well. Let me put this away. So, now that our, our, ingredient, our recipe has cooled down, okay, it has cooled down, we are going to pour in honey. 
and you will take this, come back and thank me later. And it should be two or three times more the, the size, the, the serving, the, the, should be two or three times more than the, the this, the this that you put. If you put in five mils of, of honey and garlic and all that, you put in three times of the ingredients that you put. So it can be two or three times depending on, on what you desire. Okay. So we are here. This is the final product. product is here. Now this one is ready to take. So how do we take this in uh, this uh, precious, precious, um, I call it a recipe, I call it what, this remedy. How do we take it? Um, I have some warm water here in my kettle. Yes, it is still warm. And that's the glass that contains the juice. So you take this when your, your stomach is not full. You take it very early in the morning uh, to fasten the absorption of it. You take it like 30 minutes before you eat your lunch. You take it just before you go to bed. And you will come and thank me later. So for children, this one teaspoon is enough. For uh, teenagers, I would use two. Uh, add in more two. These are, this is one and a half of the big spoon. Now, for me, because I'm used to it and it has no side effects, I normally use three tablespoons. These are six. Um, these are six. Uh, teaspoon, which are three tablespoons. It looks so good. In fact, if you're a visitor and you come to my house with this time of COVID, this is the first drink I give you. I will not give you the normal juice. I'll give you this. Because if you have carried uh, that coughing and the sneezing, this should be able to stop it. It should be able to kill the germs and the bacteria and the viruses and the fungus in your mouth. And so we can chat uh, comfortably without me being worried and uh, oh my gosh it tastes great I thank you so much for watching up to the end please subscribe to this channel please share the video and um, as we make these recipes you grow I also I, I, I grow I thank you so much God bless you